Hey guys, so I am back again today with another Dollar Tree haul for you guys. I have to be completely transparent with you guys. This is the second time that I am recording this. The first time I recorded it, I had like this little white fuzzy thing on my eyelids and I have no idea how I didn't feel it. I didn't see it. It was ridiculous and yeah, anyway. <laughs> But I'm so excited about this Dollar Tree haul that I am just going to re-record and do it all over again because I do not mind showing you guys again what I picked up. And this time actually might be a little bit more organized even than the first one. So we're all good. So the first thing that I picked up at the Dollar Tree, you know Mother's Day is coming up. So I actually picked up some cards from Kayla to her grandmas. So I thought those were super cute. And they come with the envelopes. And they are two for a dollar, so you can't beat that deal. So I love getting cards at the Dollar Tree. The weather out here in New York City is so crazy, let me tell you. Friday, it was almost 80 degrees. Saturday, or it was, it was like in the 80s. Um, Saturday, which was yesterday, I'm filming this on Sunday. Saturday, it was um, like almost 90 degrees, it was like 80 something. And today it's back down to like the 50s and 60s which i don't mind i actually really like this weather but when you're coming off of 80 something degree weather <sighs> kills you anyway i got so excited for summer <laughs> because of the 80 degree weather that i decided to pick up some flip flops i also found because of the weather this past weekend i think it just really got me so excited for summer that i found floaties and things and I went crazy but you know how the Dollar Tree is like it, it could be here today and then there are already some Dollar Trees already have 4th of July stuff out I mean mine, do, mine don't just yet but you know the, by the time I actually need these things and want these things they probably won't be there so I had to pick them up I found an inflatable kickboard just stuff for the kids and maybe some adults I don't know how big they really are but a beach ball a splash ring that looks like a watermelon. How cute is that? And another splash ring that looks like a donut. So I thought that that would be really fun for the kids. I finally found some fuzzy pens. I was so excited to find these fuzzy pens. Um, they have never had them at any of my Dollar Trees and I've been seeing them in Dollar Tree hauls for a while. So I picked up two of those. Um, one for me and one for Kayla, even though I'm sure she's going to end up with both. <laughs> uh, I got a hamper for Kayla. She needs a new hamper. Hers got a hole in it, so those are always good for her. She, her clothes are pretty small, and we usually wash clothes pretty frequently for the most part. <laughs> of course, my wipes. We always pick up these wipes in every Dollar Tree haul. You're probably going to see these wipes because I never leave the Dollar Tree without picking up at least one, two, three, maybe even four. Today, I picked up... This time, not today, because I went to, I think, two, two different Dollar Trees over this past week. Um, I picked up four. There's only three here because one is already in the bathroom. Chocolate chip cookies because Eddie and Kayla ran, like, they ran back the last pack. Yeah. It was Eddie and Kayla. Trust me. <laughs> um, of course, the reusable, they were having, like, the bonus buys. Uh, for a lot of the things and so I picked up so if it had like two of something the bonus buy had three so for the gloves I always buy these reusable rubber gloves and they actually had a two pack so I picked up a pack of those it's always a good deal I love to have those on hand and then these little Tupperwares they actually have again because I did this haul before I opened some of the stuff so I couldn't show you I can't show you the top I love it, it in the beginning of the year not in the beginning of the year hello the beginning of the school year in September they had the pack of these and it only came with two so I feel like you can never have enough Tupperwares on hand so when I saw that they had a bonus buy they had the three pack I picked them up I love these they're BPA free dishwasher safe the whole nine yards and they are twist top and they're so good I absolutely love them they're my favorite Tupperwares to use for Kayla's lunch well for her snacks really I found these candles these are the air fresh this is an angel orchid it's a three ounce candle looks like that it's a little jar 
and it smells delicious. I'm hoping it has the kind of, I'm hoping the throw matches the smell because it's actually pretty strong. It smells really good. I also found um, this little oil, what is it called? Fragrance warmer. Um, you can use the oils and the waxes in here. I would be careful with the waxes though because I'm pretty sure they'll probably get a little stuck on here. But the waxes is what I like to use. And then, of course, you put a little tea light candle in here. Just be careful where you put it. Never leave a tea light candle lit by itself. And always put it someplace that's nice and sturdy because because the wax or the oil or anything that's on there gets really hot. So that was cute. This um, was 45, 40, meh. Her YouTube channel is 45 and Fab. I love her. I love to watch her Dollar Tree hauls. And she actually recommends this. She says this is a really, really good moisturizer. And I don't know what's up with the weather out here in New York. Like I said, it's just been so up and down. My skin is so dry. It's crazy. So I'm going to give this a try and see if this really works. Uh, she said this is like they used to sell these in the pharmacies and everything. And it would be, it was prescribed. I don't know. You can go ahead and watch her Dollar Tree hauls for sure and she'll probably give you better information about this than I could but I'm gonna give that a shot I also picked up I found these uh, thinking cap activities and I found two of them one is grow your own gel balls which is really like those little I forgot what they're called and Orbeez yes Orbeez I figured it out so that's what that is <laughs> They call them gel balls, but it's really, I feel like they're just Orbeez, right? So I thought that was cool. Kayla would enjoy that. And make your own snow. Like I said, Kayla's been really into crafting and doing fun activities and stuff lately. So whatever I can find to get her hands on and off of electronics, the better. I love it. Then I also found these Jot two-piece envelope closures. So it's basically, let me see that, hold on. It's just these, she has a bunch of like art, like I said, she's just been so into doing art projects and stuff. She has a bunch of her drawings and paintings just hanging around the house. So I thought that this would be cute for her to be able to store them. It's beautiful flower prints, and then it's got this like red and white print, like a tribal print going on there. And they're pretty big. They had two, they had another envelope that was a little smaller than this. This one looks like it'll fit like construction size paper so that's why I got it so she can put her little her artwork projects in there mm. I have nowhere to put things there's a lot of stuff here guys and then I also found last year I got into um, planting basil and I told myself after my basil died last year we went on vacation and I forgot about it my poor basil baby died on me so I told myself I was gonna go to Trader Joe's again this year and buy another basil plant and actually plant it in a beautiful little planter and really take care of it this summer being that I'm not planning to go anywhere this summer except for my mother's pool in her backyard that's about as far as I'm going this summer maybe we'll see um and so I bought two of them because then I also have an aloe plant there that's growing out of the little container the little tin that it's in so how pretty are these guys beautiful spring colors I love them I think they're so pretty and they're just just tin cans super cute they had a whole bunch of different colors of those they had plastic like their gardening stuff at the Dollar Tree is just really really cute and then of course planter soil because you know we're gonna need that if we're gonna be planting the things thought that would be a cute little project for Kayla to help me with I have these like candle holder things in my living room and I have one in my entryway that I want to put a little candle in so I just picked up these little pillar candles and you just flip them on and they flicker in the little jar I figured it would look like the real candles in there and then Ajax for doing adulting things this pretty tote bag I just, I, I don't know why, I for a dollar, I think this is just really great, great quality. It's pretty big, as you can see, it's a pretty sizable bag, and I thought that this was the nicest print that they had. Not to say that the other prints weren't nice, they just kind of weren't my style. Um, they had some really bright colors and stuff, and I just didn't think that. I really just like the plain old basic stuff, so for a dollar, you guys, you can't go wrong. It's really sturdy stuff. I'm pretty sure you've seen this in other other hauls, but it's really sturdy. If you guys can find these, this is definitely a great buy. 
for real at the Dollar Tree. Good stuff. Then my husband, I have one of these in red that I always make my iced coffee in. My husband is always like, when are you gonna get me one? Well, here you go, babe. I got you one. <laughs> and then I have, guys, I have this storage room. And let's not act like we all don't have this one room in our house or this one place in our house that we just don't want to get into, right? That place that if you pull something off a shelf or if you open the door, it's just going to explode on you and everything's going to fall apart. That's my storage room right now, you guys. And I am not looking forward to getting in there, but I know that I have to because right now I go in there and I go to pull something off the shelf and either I run out real quick or I hope that nothing else falls over as I'm pulling this one thing off the shelf. So, storage stuff. I think Dollar Tree is probably one of the best places if you need small storage things, and that's kind of what I need right now, things to kind of put little small things that I have on the shelves away. So I picked up four of these white bins. They're just the plain, white bins, hello, plastic bins. They're just the plain plastic bins with the, um, with the lids to go on top, they look like that. So that's gonna be perfect to put all of my little knickknacks in, all of my Dollar Tree haul stuff in. <laughs> then I also picked up some of the colorful bins that they had, just because I thought that they would look cute on the shelf. Not that anybody goes into the storage room for anything, so they probably wouldn't even see these, but just for my own sake, I guess. I picked up some of the colorful bins. These are actually really big, you guys, really spacious. Oh, they have like a foam block in there, I don't know. Really spacious and they're stackable, which is great um, if I need to have more than one at a time. So I picked up the mint green ones and then this blue color and I got four. And then for Kayla's room, Kayla's playroom is a hot mess right now, you guys. She's got little toys and little things all over the place, so I plan to get into her room also. So I just figured I would just stock up on storage stuff from the Dollar Tree while they have it in stock, right? Because we know how the Dollar Tree rolls and by next week they probably won't have any of it. So I picked up the same bins that I picked up for my storage room, but I picked them up for Kayla in pink for her playroom. And then I also picked up these this round one. It almost reminds me of like a little round wicker basket. It's really cute. And then this one also, I don't know which one I'm going to use, but I know that Kayla, obviously, like any child, likes to take toys and stuff when she goes in the bath, she takes a bath or a bubble bath or whatever. So I figured these would be great to store just those toys that she takes all the time with her to the bathroom because it has the holes all around. So when she puts them back into the bucket, they'll have a place where they can be and also dry well um, because of the because of the holes they can circulate so I don't know if I'm gonna use this one or this one just yet but either one of them would probably go well also for like art supplies when she's carrying her art supplies from room to room because they both have this one has the handles on the side and this one has that cute little basket feel so either way I can interchange them so it's fine and I think that's it you guys I think that's it I showed you everything that I got from the Dollar Tree this week I love the Dollar Tree you guys so be sure to give this video a thumbs up if you love the Dollar Tree as much as I do it encourages me to just continue to put up more Dollar Tree videos because I just love going there I find any reason to go there so thumbs up this video so that I can find another reason to go there but thank you guys so so much for watching um, welcome to all of our new subscribers thank you for subscribing to our channel we're so excited to get new content out to you guys we I feel like we're kind of getting back into the swing of things and we're getting good vibes in and we're so excited um, so I'm hoping the next couple of videos are gonna be just as cool hoping to get some lunch videos out to you guys soon and also some vlogs as well so stay tuned for that be sure to subscribe you guys and turn on that little notification bell so that when you know when our videos sorry about that guys I <laughs> my phone died on me right when I was about to end the video so now I'm standing here by the wall with my phone plugged in but I had to save oh my gosh what is happening to my hair it is the end of the day you guys so excuse my craziness and excuse how I look but thank you guys I just I've got to end the video right I can't just let it be there right so thank you guys so so much for watching we love you guys and we will see you in our next video bye